Hello people, this is Glenn again, back with another video. Today I'm going to show you the Austrian coins that were used in the 50s. Now some of you looking at these coins will say, oh, some of these coins were used later than that. Yes, they were. We are talking about the 2 and 5, which were minted until uh, 1994, and were really not uh, used at that time. The last mintage for both that was a high mintage was a uh, 1991. So during the 90s they weren't really used. Okay, so we have the 1, 2, 5, 10, 20, 50 groschen and 1, 2 and 5 shilling. They, these are pretty basic coins. Uh, this is a one year type, only 1947. And the first one's to be issued we 50 1 and 2 issued 1946 and then there was the 1 groschen and 10 groschen in 47 then in 48 was the 5 groschen then in 50 was the 2 and 20 and in 52 the 5 groschen 5 shilling so should i say now a lot of these were demonetized at different dates like um the 2 was demonetized in 1957. The 10, oh, the 10 and 20 were demonetized in 59. And the rest of these aluminium ones demonetized in 1961. Uh, these, well, this one was not uh, minted after 1947. It's still legal tender up until 2002. And these two were demonetized in 2002. Now, if you don't know, Austria was part of uh, Germany during the Second World War. And after the Second World War, the Allied occupied forces issued banknotes. And these coins were issued in, in the dates I've just specified. In 1947, um, there was a revaluation, but these coins were not affected. So they just continued to circulate. So the one... A zinc and it's a uh, pretty similar if I take the 1, 5 and 10 out you will see that they are pretty much the same as the coins issued in Nazi Germany so it's the 10 Reichsfennies <laughs> you put it together oops Drop them. so quite obviously the um, Vienna Mint had a lot of uh, planchets, so it's just a lot easier to um, mint coins, mint coins for to replace other coins that are in circulation. Okay, and these are zinc. The two is aluminium. This one is aluminium bronze, and these are aluminium. And this. Five shilling was actually replaced by a silver coin. Okay, just as that. Republic Österreich. Österreich is the Austrian word for Austria. No, German word for Austria, should I say. Sorry. To Germans. And it just means Eastern Empire. And on the back it has a coat of arms. It has a hammer and a sickle. And the chains which represent its independence from Germany again. Also on the eagle has the Austrian coat of arms with the Austrian flag on it. All these are pretty much the same. This one has uh, grapes down the bottom and wheat up the top. Yeah, coat of arms again. This one has uh, a sower, so he's spreading seed on the ground. Coat of arms again. This one's 50... Russian coat of arms. So they're all pretty much the same. They all have the coat of arms. Not bad. Quite like this coin set. I've been wanting to get this for a while. Okay. So those are the coins of Austria. If you have any questions about them, leave it down below. And I will see what I can actually dig up for you. So thank you very much and have an awesome day.